search predictions as well as the flood modeling. We're here this morning to announce evacuation orders for some parts of the county. Good morning, everyone. The, um, the evacuation this morning is a mandatory evacuation order, uh, and that is as mandatory as can be. We, you know, we will not be going house to house and forcing people to leave, but we are stressing the importance of people uh, getting out of harm's way uh, uh, based on the, the surge models. Um, so the evacuation will be zone A. You can look at our website and see exactly where that is. Starting to get a little bit of wind, not much, just a little bit. Got to go check on the water level. Already getting a little bit of stream flood. Hadn't even really started raining yet. I mean, obviously it's raining, has been for a little bit, but nothing compared to what it's going to be. A little bit of wind. Let's see what this canal looks like. A little bit windier than I thought. Once the wind really picks up, this water is going to raise a lot. That's kind of cool. Feet. Upwards of 12 feet from this level. Which is mind-boggling. Rain's definitely coming down harder now. Getting a nice little cell coming through. And at times the wind picks up for a second. Of course it won't do it while I'm out here, but. It's coming down pretty good now. Wind still hasn't really picked up that much. It's blowing, but not as hard as it could be. Look at this. Oh, that's cool looking. That looks crazy.
just depends how big the cell tower goes down or not. Oh yeah, yeah. I did. I just went to these off the dock last night. I brought them up last night just to make sure they're off in case the dock was closed. So.
south than it's going to want to look forward. But my front line is tied off, and I have another. Freed up boat right there, heading right for us. Take a picture in case they got damage. Okay. There it goes, squeezing between them. Right over my fence. He's taking on water. He's back in. Yeah, I see it. He's, He's taking on water, so it's going to sink. Right in your backyard. Right over the top of my fence. The boat approached us. It's now getting water taken on from the back end. We'll be ready to sink shortly. Not supposed to be there. <laughs> that is. The boat's in your yard. In case you didn't know. Yeah. Well, it's just, it's just the boat? It's in your yard. So, here. Yeah. Is that another one? Yep, here comes another one. Where? That's the one from up above. Yeah, that's the one that was missing the cover, right? Yep. Oh, pontoon. Yeah. yeah. Oh, frick. I would let's, be hope it blows. let's hope it blows to the right. I'd be surprised if this is the last one, too. Yep. Yeah. This is not what we want to be at, but we get an impact. Furniture's <laughs> moving, too. Hell yeah. And yet another pontoon boat blowing in, coming to visit. How many more boats? Oh, many more. There's a mine if you want them. Now it's
That's the one with the tarp. Coming a little too far left. The canopy is on it. It's all wrapped around it. At least it's sideways. That way it blows off the right. It might. Goes out that corner. And this is over for now. It's hanging, hanging steady. Another boat coming to visit. This one might be headed for your boat. Yeah, we got another boat coming to visit. Straight at us. What are you going to do? Swim out. Come on, we in. Blow north. Blow north. Blow it north. Come on, big gust. Blow it off. There's a little one. Push it to the left. Push it left. There goes the Two boats here. That one there, that one there. What? Yeah, upstairs. Right. Upstairs to the right. Can you bring any? There's chips, there's granola bars. Um, Did you not bring anything on? I think there's nuts. I got snacks up, upstairs. Okay. Just minimum. Yeah, mine wasn't further than I had. Oh no, it's all good for y'all. Minimum. The whole bag full. One of my plans should stop from touching my bag. The lift is shut. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's Oh, 
Trees took an absolute beating. Oh hell yeah! But yet, almost all of our It's hoping to get some of this color, but it's not really showing up. As far as I can tell. Right. It's almost like pink purple. Yeah. You can see it on the white the top white part of my boat. Yeah. Get the light reflecting back. What's up, man?
damage of a high end category four, low end category five hurricane looks like. There's shingles everywhere. They're missing a good chunk of it. Can only imagine my roof looks the same. We'll find out. Look at these trees. That one didn't do too bad. A lot of these are just toast. That fence is toast. Crazy. Absolutely crazy. That tree's ripped up. Tree down in the backyard. More shingles everywhere. <laughs> this yard light out in the middle of the street. Road street. Absolutely, we're underwater. Every tree has been ripped up. It goes a long way to the house, show you this big tree on the way. That tree down in the middle of the road that I'm not gonna walk by in the driveway. Their mailbox plug. Look at those trees, man. One of my favorite sights was coming into the neighborhood seeing those trees. Evacuated, it looks like. Their fence is toast. I bet mine's gonna be the same. Got fence posts all over here. Or whatever you call the middle section of the fence between the posts. They're smart, they brought their boat out of the water. They had their gutter ripped off or their trim, I guess. That tree has been stripped. Looks like they evacuated as well. feet of water. I'm surprised it cleared out so quickly. I figured it would take another day at least. Well, I guess he didn't evacuate. <laughs> I don't know what that was, but it's half standing now.
massive tree too. Just look at this tree. guys Uh, avoid that. Power's out, but I'll still 
throw it on plastic. some of the really expensive shingles missing like ceramic or something so crazy hurricane Ian put a wallop on Cape Coral this is not a name you'll ever hear on another storm again It's going to have its own Wikipedia page. <laughs> what a storm. Is that a birdhouse? Oh, a smell box. That tree always looked like that. It looks like it's been like rubbed. I don't know if you can even really see it. It's a bright sky behind it. Quote unquote bright. This tree though, I just don't can't get over this tree. And that tree over there. Absolutely insane.